Hello everybody, so in today's video we're just gonna see, check out a different filing store. I had a reaction today giving support to somebody who said it's really hard to do the stuff with the codes. That was the reaction. So the code is right here when you launch it. You can erase this or punch in something new. So I just punched in 8 times 2. 8 times 2. And the first time when you access this store, it will ask you for a PIN number. And the, the PIN number will be 4754. So it's a guy. He works with boxes and file sticks more. And this is his setup. So click. You're granted access to his store. Of course, you'll see the PIN number. You just punch in the PIN number. He sells a VPN. And from that point on, there's a lot, just dismiss the, the notification. A lot of application. As I said, my favorite is cinema. And you guys know that I use it all the time. But there's a lot of other apps. And there's no way to limit yourself to one app when you know there's a lot of other apps available. So, for example, if I want to download MediaBox, again, this process just is the same as what we always do. Only for the different app. So basically what I'm saying, we're doing always the same. The only thing that changes is the name of the app. And at any given time, if I don't like the app, I can uninstall it because it's quite simple. <coughs> so it's downloading the app, Media Box in this case. And it, he tells me that it was updated on November 11. It's a 2019 update for this app supposed to be nice but as we already know there's a lot of really nice apps so I'll download one of these and then of course uh, like I usually do I will also check out one of the live TV applications and we'll see what he has to offer I didn't really look in this section so done and I'm scrolling down back to all of these apps, there's a lot of them. So, sure, you're gonna find something that you like. More, more, more. Here it is free TV. So, we know LiveNet, Ola TV. I don't know what it is. HD streams looks interesting. And okay, let's try HD streams because I never really used it. We can try it together. <coughs> Click and stop. <coughs> so basically what I did, I just downloaded two different apps. One is for on-demand movies and TV shows, and the other one is for live TV. As most of you already know, this is my favorite way of working with beginners, usually, because I want to make it simple. So I'm just opening up my app section. And going, first thing will be going to HD Streams because I want to check it out. I'm really curious. So, okay, click. Agree to whatever they want. Just want access to the app. Comes up. Okay, allow. Thanks for you. You're welcome. Now, let's see what's going on here. There's a menu. Network, stream, radio records, report, channel, copyright. Okay. That's one thing. And then I see there's a live TV section here. Indo. Bunch of stuff. Let's see. Okay, so there's India. There's US. And you can always choose more. So, for example, if I want to access all the U.S. channels. Oh, it just changed. And very interesting. But let's see. How does it look? So. Mm -hmm. 
Very nice. A couple of tips for avoiding so just another live TV app. First. Really nice. With a bunch of channels. You can choose different countries, including Canada right here. Sportsnet. Oh, just the sports category. I love it. <laughs> well, some of, some of you guys will love this. Let's see how it works. I chose uh, TSN just to see if it works. Good. And a different quality as well. So why not try it, right? So I'm coming out of this application because there's too many stuff to, to see. I see there's a lot, a lot, a lot of different uh, countries and different sections on it. Okay. So I'm going to come out of this app. And I'm going to go and launch my second application that I downloaded. That will be Media Box. Here it is. Click. Doesn't work. I'll give it another chance. Oh, it doesn't want to work. So I'm just going to try to download a different app. It happens. Never really used this store before, so I was doing something random. So let's do BTV. Now I know BTV. I like it. Most cases. Still my favorite will be cinema. I just download it. This is the advantage of having a lot of sources for apps. If something doesn't work, you can always choose something else. BTV. Comes up. Okay. Loads very fast, I noticed. Movies. It used to take more time. They have an editor's choice here. Some people like this section, especially WWE. So let's see how it looks. Play. Cancel. Scraping and searching and then just gonna choose something to play quick here. Just something cool to play with. There's a lot of sections, a lot of shows. Highest growth scene, new movies from 2019. Amazon shows, Fox, Netflix shows. Pretty cool application altogether, something to play with. So this is it. Just every time, if you're working with file links, it means that you're using a specific code. Make sure that you're using the code that you're actually interested in using for now and all through the year and a half. I've been using three different codes and it's been working pretty good for me. So I hope it's working good for everybody else. Thank you.